one of the things that we often talk about is actually what an advantage it is to be women filmmakers in that region, which doesn't usually come as a natural, um, you know, as an obvious thing. But um, you actually can, you know, to, to your question in terms of being able to film with the women, uh, you can film inside the home a lot more with the women if you are a woman. It's harder for you to be allowed into the, into the more private spaces of the home um, if you are a man only with the women, right? So if you're a man and you, you are in the kitchen and there's only women there, you're probably going to be asked to leave. Uh, but if you're a woman, you can kind of like be in that space. And the other thing is actually that there is a sense of, uh, I often felt like the man um, wouldn't, w wouldn't be, feel threatened by us. Uh, which actually allow them to be a lot more relaxed around us than, you know, if I think there is a there is something culturally, which I don't think it's actually just to be fair. I don't think it's actually just about filming in the Middle East. I think there's something about that in our own culture, where um, uh, you know I think men might feel more threatened if it's another man than if it's a woman, um, and they might need to feel like they need to stand up to some kind of level of expectation about what they're going to say, uh, whereas I think um, um, we were able to get them to, to feel less like they were performing and more like they were having a conversation, which I think is one of the key shifts you want to make in an interview, um, especially when you're talking about something where people have so much training in talking to journalists about.